Waigo ni gaba ya msia banyara bao kwanra chivura buru ichia Gendra kwenye kiwa sense miya nene Ejanya tiji kwenye kiwa Tukuliko roa sumu ya msibu wadi ya umuagamo Ao chereletue ni nyomba ya ye Kusambwa ubotukubugo kira Igor As you are all aware Honor members One of our members Was affected by the kills that were caused yesterday morning Now I invite you to make a comment, but stick and to the law and the standing orders of the Nyamira County Assembly. If there was not some demonstration or, or, or a gathering to the police, we would like to know if he had sought for assembly of uh, members of the party. If it is not, then he went against the law. And these activities could have been arranged following one after the other, from organizing, from demonstrations, from throwing of stones and uh, uh, tearless canisters to even touching uh, 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 houses. Our assembly was touched, one of Myangana's house was touched, and I understand that as we talk, several members of the assembly are under threat and they have resorted to employing private guards in their homes. Honorable Speaker, our security should be noted to have been threatened as members of the House, and we request that this House arranges for security of Honorable Members, uh, Speaker. Yesterday was really a sad day to the Count Assembly of Limira. To wake up and hear that one of our own property has been touched. We sometimes fail to understand why politics has to turn to that extent of being so evil. Suppose the owner remember the family were inside and were trying to get out. We'll be talking about funerals right now. But we thank God Almighty that he saved Honorable Yangana's family. That due to our political inclinations, we can be sacrificed. Mr. Speaker, I want to believe the touching of uh, Honorable Yangana's homestead <laughs> and the dosing of our gentleman were well calculated moves, Mr. Speaker. I want to say this because the, the act happened simultaneously. Because we are told that our gateman was burnt at around 3 in the morning. And at, at around 3, 3.30 to 3.45, Yangana's home was burnt down, Mr. Speaker. It pains, Mr. Speaker, to note that but uh, building material, materials are so costly these days. With the, with, with the current economic situation in the country, where goods have skyrocketed, Mr. Speaker, I pity Honorable Nyangana because he's going to dip so heavily into his...